The Ubo Kingdom over the weekend was a beautiful sight to behold as indigenous and people from all walks of life gathered to celebrate the ninth coronation anniversary of the monarch, the Ulubo of Ubo land, his imperial majesty, Oba Frederick Obatero. Lots of encomiums were showered on the monarch concerning his achievements since he assumed leadership of the Ubo land. The Commissioner for Environment, Funcho Esson, reeled out some of the impact the monarch made in the society. You could see the number of people that are here. It's uh, becoming cordial. And uh, you could know the antecedent. When he came on the throne, uh, somebody was there before. And, uh, you know, because that person was not properly installed, and uh, when he came, they are bound to be acrimony and... Uh, some people might not be happy, but uh, I think all that is history now that uh, everybody you know, have come to accept him as the paramount ruler of Ugoland. Also speaking, the special advisor to the Ondo State Governor on Education, Olawuni Ilaole, had some kind words. I wish him long life, more prosperous years on the throne, peace in his domain, in his community, in his kingdom, and more prosperity for him and the people of Elijah in general. The Crown Prince of the Kingdom, Akin Femiwa Akin Ruton, said this of his father. This is the 90th anniversary anyway, and the next day is the 10th anniversary. So we just believe we just do something really small, but I'm, I'm surprised at the turnout we have for this anniversary. So it is quite um, impressive, and it, it tells us a lot of the acceptability of His Imperial Majesty on the throne. I wish him many, 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 many more years on the throne of his forefathers. Using his coronation anniversary to erect the statue of Queen Morimi, who the monarch said was the Ulubo of Ubo's first wife, Oba Obatero wished everyone well. And I want to thank you sincerely for celebrating my nice years today. And it's very significant to me, that nine years, very significant. But next year, what I have in mind is to plan it, in a, you know, not in a big way. I thought with some 20 people, even 10, a lot of prayer. The pastor will come and pray for me. We go. But I never expected all this crowd. But there's nothing I could do. Yeah, suffering, I suffering. That's my good luck. That's what I brought from, from heaven. And I want to thank you sincerely, everybody. You are welcome to this place, to my house here. This is my palace. I can welcome Queen Elizabeth here. I have a parlor, I have a sitting room for him. Captain Television's Dara Cyril reports that dignitaries, which included government officials, the clergy, traditional rulers, and various bodies, witnessed the occasion, which had lots of traditional dancing, music, and entertainment.